Friday night, time to trip. <laughs> if you hit me in my leg with your guitar again, I'm gonna have to go to the hospital. <laughs> You've sure. already been there enough, so I'll try not to. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Take What's a up? hit from the bong. Take a hit. Good to see you guys. It's Buscaroo. Yeah, man, it's great to be back. Another Friday of psychedelia, rock and roll with my brother. It's nice to be jamming with my bro, you know? It's great. Jed uh, is really mad at me because we have a beautiful plant array over here, as you can see. and. Um, I just keep knocking them over. <laughs> I broke like a pot, and uh, and then my mom got really mad at us because we're out at my mom's celebrating motherhood. He's spilling beers. He's knocking tables over. Speaking of beers. Oh, speaking of beers. Let's, what's tonight's beer, everybody? We're going to surprise you with an interesting beer, something we've been drinking a lot lately. Yep. little Tyski from Poland. Polish beer. Talk about it while I open it, man. It's a pleasure to be here tonight with everybody. I would Polish. like to tell you that that's a Euro lager. As far as I What's understand. That mean? I don't know, but it gets you wasted. <laughs> All right. All right, how do so you do? Anyway. nights. What? <laughs> so giddy, dude. I'm just so happy that uh, it seems to be broadcasting. Is it sounding all right out there? You guys want to say something Chiclet, in the chat everybody. room about that? Cheers, Lachayim. Yeah. Cheers, everybody. Cheers, everybody. This one is a, I'm gonna, we're going to take a sip. So everyone pause, take a sip. The beer tradition, Steve Barnsworth. That's us, Stevie, baby. Uh, this beer, you know, being from Poland, you can really, you get a nice woodsy taste, and yep. then the back end hits you with, like, a couple of, um, you know, some pork sausage, man. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's just a wood it's pork sausage. It's like a sausage. schnitzengruben meets um, uh, little hops. It's very, I'd say it's very hopsy. Yeah. I mean, it makes you crave. You just want to suck down a couple of these and some pierogies, man. Suck what? All right. Don't go there. That's right. Rule everybody. number one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, man. Uh, everyone, we're looking into the chat room. And we're looking into our crystal ball. We're seeing you know, all kinds of crazy things happening tonight for our show. We're going to play a lot of trippy music. I think this music is going to be a little bit mental tonight because I'm feeling a little mental. I licked 10 sheets of acid. I drank three shots of whiskey. And uh, I did about five lines of Coke. And like right now, I'm just starting to feel it, you know, a little bit. It's starting to kick in. Before we go in to our next tune, I just want to um, quickly say we're being simulcasted over. Ooh! Yeah, that's right. Michael Del Tufo, DJ Del Tufo at uh, One Great Mix on Ustream. And I'm going to, I'll pop the link in here now. For Mike D! He goes on till, uh, for another few hours. So after us, 
um, please go over there and enjoy the rock and roll. Yeah, the jet. I mean, he plays a lot of great disco tunes from 70s. Disco, rock, everything. Modern. The whole gamut, if I may say so myself. And uh, we'll put the link in again later. But um, in the meanwhile, I just want to do one more thing real quick. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you guys ever this. heard of a band, uh, a little band called The Doors? Yeah, we actually, you know, uh, we did uh, some stuff where we were asking people for uh, requests. You know, songs you might want us to give the Heth and Jed spin. Twist, twist. Yeah, twist. a little twisty spin on it. And um, we've been I getting hope Jim. tons. We've been, you know, just making our way through all the suggestions. And when we hit one, it works. Oh, yeah, Cypress Hill, hit from the bong, baby. Dig a we hit do. from we, the bong. We do play that one, actually. <laughs> we'll, uh, maybe we'll throw it into this later. But um, in the meantime, here's... Um, Here's a little Doors tune. There's a little Doors for you guys. Little Riders on the Storm. We're going to just give it the Heth and Jed treatment, baby. One, one, one two, two, one. Do it. Live, live TV, bro. Gotta love it. Have had too many beers, too many joints. So we're gonna do it. I'm gonna do it, but we're not using the loop we have programmed. Yeah. We're gonna create the loop. That's cool. One, two. Sweet. you 
depends on Thank you, Jimmy. We love you, baby. Jim just stopped in for me. Just beamed in, man. Beamed in for a brewski, for a Tyski. <laughs> One of these boys. Yeah. What's up out there, you guys? I was getting a little out there. There. That's the first time we ever really played that with um, come with some of these interesting sounds. It's fucking cool. That's right. It's very I cool. Like it. It's fun I'm to play this, the new shit. I'm using this thing called a Whammy, Digitech Whammy. Google that, Digitech Whammy. And uh, the guy from... Uh, um, what's that band? Rage Against the Machine. That's like his signature thing. Like he uses that effect like in oh, every yeah. song. He's really every song. adept. Uh, <laughs> he, he knows how to use it. <laughs> yep. Speaking of great bands, we um, did everyone check out the uh, Library of Congress announcement? I think it was either this morning or yesterday. The um, National Recording Registry, and they they're sort of like a reliquary of just um, of oh, art. What? Really a, a relic. Oh, sorry. Should I not use big words? Dumb it down, man. Dumb it down. A reliquary. So they have, um, nice. they just inducted Dark Side of the Moon and um, Bridge Over Troubled Water, uh, The Twist by, uh, what's his name? Uh, Chubby Checker. Chubby Checker. Chubster. And a lot of other ones, but they have about 325 or 375 worth of um, songs. And um, it's all songs that they just, you know, that have contributed to the culture and contributed in a you know, in a very innovative way and just made a big impact on society. And uh, it's pretty cool. I think... You know, these days you forget, you, you know, some of the, everything's so instant and it's so great to have something that's from a long time ago that still, you know, blows minds, you know? Did that blow your mind, that article about it? No, but um, the albums did. Uh-huh. Ha-ha. <laughs> I know, it's true, man. I feel like uh, some of those records will hold up for eternity, man. Yeah. Martians will be listening to them. And it's just cool because I think from when we're, when we're out there playing, so we talk about it a lot, that art is important. Tell them. And the preservation of the art is important. <laughs> and I think that to see like the Library of Congress, you know, saying we need to we need to induct these things and we need to just keep reminding people that art's important. And you know, banks are important too, but art's important also. Totally, man. And on that note, on that note, what are we doing? Desert Sun. All right, let's do another, babies. One, one, two, three, one, one, two, two.
me up like a desert sun Take me back to you Times in my youth Voices are telling me Places remind me to Looking through, you lift me up when the day is done. And what do I see? Whoa, you know it's you, yeah. You warm me up like a desert sun. about like a live broadcast is that everything works awesome <laughs> up until the point like uh, all the chords and all the effects work perfectly until you hit until you go live and then everything doesn't work that's the gremlin effect <laughs> yeah, i think <laughs> everything's it's come it's supposed to be like that that just adds to the got to keep you on your there. toes man do you want to change any chords or are you cool i told my roadie to fucking work on this shit <laughs> and you're fired bro he's fired man holy shit but that's Desert Sun, man. Anything going on in the chat room? I don't know. I've been trying to just keep everything plugged in properly, man. <laughs> Everyone, thanks so much for chilling with us through totally. Facebook, through Ustream, through Twitter, through Sphincter Stream. 
everything, man. You guys are awesome. And um, let's do a little commercial for buying us a little uh, brewski. Buy yeah. us a brew. Oh yeah, here you go. We're so unprepared today. It's awesome. We're just hanging out, rocking it. I told you we need to get a production crew in here. Yeah. To do this right. Ha! Yeah. And we're doing it right because two people playing music and working the board. So what you see here is a little bit of a a, a place where if you felt like uh, buying us a beer, go to that link right now and. Um, yeah, if you want to show free. your support for the band as you're partying and chilling at home, please do. Um, we really appreciate yeah, it. It's just at our website, buy us a beer link. And, um, and if you don't want to buy us a beer, hang out and enjoy it. I'm glad you're here chilling with us tonight. It's awesome. Oh, man. yeah. Just a little. We feel very grateful. Totally rocking with us. Best. I do want to play with a chord for a second. So why don't you talk for a second, man? Okay. I don't mind if I do. So um, are you fixing that? But now it's working, so it'll, it'll work until we start the, the next tune, <laughs> I think. Yeah. So I want to just say to everyone, you know, this is a crazy undertaking, of course, and we couldn't have done it without a bunch of people that have been helping us. Um, Mr. No Steve Farnsworth out on the left coast. <laughs> um, he's been, he's like our media guy in social media, and he just keeps... He's in charge of my mustache. Yeah, mustache trimming. And he keeps us on our toes. And then we have uh, Mr. Michael Southworth, who has been a, an amazing kind of uh, engineer, producer of this show. And he gets all the technical bull stuff, bullshit out of the way for us and just keeps us rocking and yep. um, plugged into the net, if you will. And then we have Michael Del Tufo, DJ Michael Del Tufo, who's been simulcasting us with. He has a great, great Ustream yeah. channel, and he's been a great supporter. And, we just um, can't do it without you guys. And then we have all the people that just showed you know, up to chill with us. Come man. out and rock. We have Francesco in Italy. We love you, man. What's up, man? And, you know, John is here in the chat room. And Craig's supposed to be here. Yeah. And we also, uh, Craig, and I'm going to read this because I can't remember all your, your family's names. This is like the Uncle Floyd show. If we anyone just want to say like a big shout out to a guy who's been real inspiration to us, too, for uh, Craig, Nina, Ryan, Carolyn, Lauren, and Paris Eret. You guys uh, are, you know, ridiculous. <laughs> awesome. They said we're going to be on their 64-inch TV right now. Yeah, are we on the 64? I don't know. <laughs> I hope it's uh, looking good. <laughs> I got to have some more beer or I'm going to Good, die. Good uh, thing it's not smell-o-vision, Jed, or they wouldn't be able to take you. That is correct. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh, heck. We're going to do Black and Blue. It's a love song that we've been kind of working on. Um, and um, I'm going to make the beat for it, and we're going to rock it. You know, the layers are the part of our broadcast that um, we bring from the streets. Like, we grew up doing all these loops because we didn't have a drummer for a while. So I would always be laying down these loops on the street and um, seeing what happens as you put in the layers. And uh, yeah. and we got pretty, our, like, our own little way of putting in the percussion. And um, I think sort of uh, it brings the uniqueness to what we do. But we don't, like, rely on it. Like, some people are like, well, I'm a looper, man. For us, it's just, like, fits in with the, the cosmic consciousness. Yeah. I mean, remember, we played a, um, out in Colorado at a radio festival one time, a long time ago, and we saw Howie Day. Oh, right, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's awesome, and he was, um, he was, he did a one-man show, mm -hmm. and a solo show, and he had a looper, and we were like, we couldn't believe like what he was doing. He yeah. had his own technique, and then we sort of. Um, Joseph Arthur is another killer guy. Yeah, Joseph guy. Arthur. If you well, look for Joseph Arthur on Jules Holland's show, you'll see a guy who's beyond any level of looping. Like, I don't know what <laughs> he's doing. It's yeah. outrageous. It's really totally. cool. And so this one is called Black and Blue. And this is a pretty song about, you know, what happens chilling, when you chilling, fall chilling, in love chilling. and um, someone rips your fucking heart out. Nice. 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 Lay it down, broski. Lay it down, lay it down, lay it down, lay it down, lay it down. 
living in this world Faded kisses and poison tears Jen. There was nothing you could say before you left Ran at full speed out of breath Didn't beg for mercy cause you know Thank you so much for chilling with us tonight, man. Sweet. That's something that Jed and I are, uh, we think it's a hit, right? Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a, it's a hit. big internet hit. <laughs> 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 so we love you guys, man. You guys are so awesome for coming out here and just chilling with us and indulging us. I'm and letting uh, us. I finally starting to warm up a little bit. The first few yeah. songs, my chords were kind of tripping, but I feel, feel good. You've been today. tripping all day long, actually. I know. It's like I'm not out. even on drugs. It was seriously, it was like <laughs> hanging out with an alien, man. 
Like any time uh. you want to, you know, do something. <laughs> oh, you want to know why? Mo moderately normal. I'm in a lawsuit. Let me know. It's tripping me out. <laughs> Oh. No, I'm in like three lawsuits. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> you are. No. no, I'm not. Well, they're your no. friends as long as you dominate. I wanted to be in a lawsuit for my ankle, but the guy got away. So. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'd like to do a lawsuit to that guy. Yeah. But not right either. to the crotch. Lawsuit to the crotch. <laughs> 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 Is everyone uh. drinking beers and chilling? Oh I yeah. Hope. You laying back? Lay back. 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 Lay Let's do back. something uh, really, tr really, really trippy. And uh, this might be one of our last tunes for the evening. It's getting kind of late for people. Oh, yeah. no. We got like 15 minutes or so to rock out. We like to beam in, beam out before we overstay our welcome. So this will be our last tune. And it's just, you know, kind of psychedelic jam. We've been in a pretty psychedelic mood today. Um, and uh, we'd like to honor the mood, you know? It's the Digitech whammy. I'm not kidding. You that think? thing just makes things go bugging. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I actually have the box right here. Awesome. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Yeah. And someday we're gonna get we're gonna have two cameras, and, um, yep. and maybe even um, DJ Quidgy has been suggesting having um, you know some cool cameras on uh, the fretboard. So we need some fretboard action too, so we can have like. But six you need a second going. computer. Is that the whole issue? Yeah, we, we need it. So we need about sixty grand. And a no. bunch of equipment. <laughs> I bet we could do it for five. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. This is good enough, It's actually. just money, guys. So sweet. So, sweet. so, so, so sweet. hope you're laying back. And if you're about to blow a fatty, let's do it, man. This one's going right, to go right to the uh, nut job for you. Here we go. One, three, two, two, three. One, two, three, two, two, three. <laughs>
was trippy, man. We're at the Jed. This is Bus Guru, man. This is the Bus Guru show on uh, yeah, Ustream, yeah, yeah, yeah. where everybody yeah, gets yeah, to chill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ustream is the shit, and we love you straight. equipment blows that was like a hendrix move <laughs> that was it was good feedback no the ending was great <laughs> i liked it sweet so what's up you guys i was hope that was a chilled out jam yeah man as intended sweet i was sweet, gonna uh, just uh sweet, talk sweet, about this one little issue sweet, before we bail out i was gonna say me and jed are you know getting used to um we're working on a reality show and it's like not reality show like honey boo boo but it's like about you know buskers and dudes that honey are boo -boo. honey boo boo honey boo boo She's my third wife. So you're soon to be, right? right? Give her 15 years, yeah. dude. I know. I, so, got two uh, more to, I got one more to go and then third one. Anyway, I don't know what you're talking about. But anyway, my point is this, that uh, we're gonna ha we have a reel going out, and we're just looking around for people to uh, rock with us and uh, to do our show. And um, it, we wrote all the music for it. It's been really pretty exciting. But in doing this, we've been uh, looking at like, other reality shows. So we, we checked out like Fast and Loud. I really dig that show mm -hmm. with Richard Rawlings. And, um, like, you know, of course, Duck Dynasty and all these really cool things that are... Um, but everything's are about rednecks. either I know, I know. killing animals or uh, being, like, kind of, like, closeted racist. Well, I was going to say that. Because every time I watch the show, like, my girlfriend's Asian, so we're watching <laughs> Fast and Loud, and this guy, Richard Rollins, he's, like, he's talking about their Asian seamstress they have. And he's, like, if she gets mad at me... She's going to give me a karate chop. And he starts doing these moves. And I was like cringing, man, with <laughs> my girlfriend. And yeah. she looked at me like, like, it's like, how come you can do that? And I think there's a racism is coming back or something. I don't know. Man. I think it's just coming out of the house. It never went away. I mean, racism, anti-Semitism kind of went back in the house for a while. Really? A couple decades. Mm. And I think now it's like, it's showing its head again. And it's like acceptable. There's like a little race war going on or something. I hope I not. Know. Just drink beers and chill out, everybody. Relax, just man. chill out. Can't you, know? you just do it? So, oh, good night. Yeah. <laughs> it was great rocking with you guys. I hope we see you next Friday night. It's going to be our, uh, maybe our last show for a while because we want to do five shows in a row. Is that it? We're doing four. We got one more next week. Yep. Uh, I can't use my equipment. Oh, <laughs> all right. I thought we'd play it out. <laughs> that's equipment died on us. All right. But uh, that's good to know. So, yeah. Guys, thanks for hanging out. Bus Guru, Heth and Jed, we'll see you soon. Have a beautiful okay. night, you guys. And go to, uh, bye-bye. Keep being donkeys. We love you guys. We love you guys. Rock.